Welcome to this RoadTex.com video on using hot sheets. So you might be wondering what hot sheets are. They are a collection of all jobs in a trade or a discipline that have been posted on the RoadTex.com website that day uh, and then they're rounded up and emailed to you directly. Um, from the RoadTex.com main page we can go to the main menu select daily hot sheets and you'll be taken to a page that shows all 37 of the current hot sheets that we have there are subscribe and unsubscribe links and then there's also information on the most recent hot sheet that's gone out for that discipline or job title uh, we'll take a look quickly at welder and this web page is just a representation of what went out with the email uh, at uh, 4 1 p.m. April 20th, 2017 for welder jobs that were posted that day. In this case, there are five jobs and uh, the little icon on the left indicates which job board it's posted in. You can look at the legend down here and decipher which job board it's in. If you click on the link, you'll be taken right to that job post and you can look at the details and the contact information. At the bottom of every hot sheet there are instructions on how to subscribe and unsubscribe from a hot sheet. So if you have a friend that wants to subscribe to a hot sheet that you already have you can forward them the hot sheet and they can go down to the bottom and click on the uh, subscribe link right here and the only requirement is is they'll be sent an email uh, when they click on the link it brings up an email uh, to join the hot sheet they just send that off you don't have to add anything to it and then a few seconds later they'll get an email back and they have to reply to that email again not adding anything to it just reply and send and that validates the email address that we're trying to add to the hot sheet list. Very simple. So to join, click on the link. You'll be sent a validation email. You reply to that and send it off and you'll be added to the list and then the next hot sheet that's issued will come into your inbox. Um, so hot sheets are published near the end of each day around uh, 4 or 5 p.m. Pacific time. If there are no jobs for that trade or discipline posted that day, then a hot sheet will not be published. Uh, once again, hot sheets are only opt-in, opt-out. We never subscribe anyone to a hot sheet. That's uh, something you have to do yourself. Going back to the hot sheet page, I'll just quickly explain the columns. The area or trade or discipline is the leftmost column. Uh, in this case, if you're a crane operator, this would be the row that you would want to be interested in. Uh, to subscribe to the crane operator hot sheet, you can click on this link. And then, once again, it'll bring up your email a blank email and you just send that off just like it comes up you'll get a response from the server and you have to reply to that response you don't have to add anything to it just reply and send it off and that validates your email address and you'll be added to the list if at any point you no longer wish to receive the hot sheet then just click on the unsubscribe link for the particular trade or discipline in this case, craneopleave at roadtex.com. Again, you'll be sent an email that you must reply to to verify that it's you that wants to leave the hot sheet. Uh, if you want to see the current hot sheet information for today, or at least the last one that was published, there is a column that says current hot sheet. You can click on the link there and you'll be taken to uh, a web version of the hot sheet that was published. Now when you unsubscribe from a hot sheet, you have to do that from the same email address 
that you subscribed with. Otherwise, the server isn't going to know who you are. For those of you that have Blackbook accounts, we'll talk about that next because there's a particular page right in Blackbook that handles hot sheets for you. Okay, so once you're logged into your Blackbook account, there is a tab along the top called Hot Sheets. If you click on that, you'll be shown a list of all, I think the current list is 37 uh, hot sheets that we have available for these trades and disciplines uh, over here in on the right. Uh, in this case, uh, I'm not subscri subscribed to any hot sheet in using this profile. If you wanted to subscribe to a hot sheet, you would come over and click on the not subscribed button. It'll turn green and that will start the process. It says you will be sent an email and you have to confirm by replying to that email and sending it back. Once you do that, you'll be added to the hot sheet list. At some point after you answer the, the email that the server sends you, when you reply to it and send it off, when you go back to your Hot Sheets page, you'll now see that the subscribed green button is shown for the Hot Sheet I subscribe to. And this can take a little time. It can take 15 minutes or so before you get the green button. So don't worry if it doesn't happen right away. Now, later on, if you decide you no longer want to be uh, receiving this hot sheet, again, you just need to click on the subscribed button. You'll be sent an email. You have to reply to that email to tell the server that it is indeed you that is unsubscribing, and then you'll be removed from the list and a little while later, you should see the button go back to the not subscribed gray indicator. So at some point when you go back into your hot sheet page, you'll see that the hot sheet you were subscribed to now says not subscribed and it's gray. That pretty much completes how to use hot sheets and roadtex.com. Thanks for watching.